Hello, my lovely Pisces. What is popping with you? Thank God for having us here today. Celebrating, like I said, today is the best day of our life and celebrating that we are here. In the moment, alive, okay? Alive, not dead, but alive. Pisces, y'all know I always tell y'all what I do. And I'm, I do um, rituals all the time. All right, I don't wait for the full moon. I do rituals every day. All right, and I've been telling y'all, this is what I do, and this is what I hang up in my bathroom. Right, you could put rosemary on this, but and I also write like I always tell y'all, honey. I don't play when it comes to my my dear father up in heaven. You see that, and it says, dear God, baby. Okay, get it right. Okay, I write to God all the time. And this is what I put in my bathroom and on my shower. I hang it just like that. And I let it stay maybe the most seven days. And then I change it. But this is what I do, right? And um, this is grown in my house. This right here, right? Um... I grow it and and look at the basil leaves. They are huge. So when I get done doing your reading, I will put this in my bathroom and I change them. And it smells so good. But the bottom line of this is what you need. When you do rituals, I don't know what you do, how you do it, but this is what I do, and I'm very serious about what I do, okay? I don't I take everything seriously when it comes to my spirituality, all right? We should have a march where spirituality, yes, yes, yes. They do everything. They march for everything. Okay, let me make a march for my spirituality for people because I know there's so many people out there like me, just like me in this world, all over the world, honey, all over. I don't mean... Going to church, this and that, what spirituality, like what you believe in. You understand? Like, I believe in what is the real deal, the trees, the dirt, and all this, what what makes us how we live. You know, if we don't have none of this, no air, nothing, polluting the world and water, clean water to drink and herbs and you know. You can live off of anything, honey. Believe me, if it comes down to it, you think, oh, I won't eat that. I bet you you will. I bet you you will. Huh, you talking about something you don't eat? I bet you it tastes mighty good. Then when you have to eat it and, it, and you're on survival kit mode, you won't be thinking what you think today, right? But I am, when it comes to my spirituality, I live just what it is. All right, I, I don't go by what no preachers say, what no Bible say, none of that. Um, I'm who I am, okay? And I go with the flow, and that's it, all right? It is what it is, all right? Um, like I said, I don't like walking red carpets. I want to walk a green carpet, all right? Eternal, all right? Uh. It's green everywhere, baby. Do you hear me? At the bottom of the ocean is green, okay? It's green everywhere, all over, underwater, on top of the water, everywhere. And I want to walk on the green, breathe the green, okay? Um, and you'd be surprised. It takes 30 years for a tree to grow. 30 years. And some of these trees have been growing for years and they don't stop growing. You understand? That's what makes what makes me sad when there's storms and these trees just fall right over. They're so beautiful, right? Um, but they can be very dangerous, right? So I just live, just believe in what's in front of me. All right, without everything around us, we will not be able to live in homes. All right, have a roof over our head, stoves, refrigerators, you know, food, water, 
clothes. You understand? It's real. The shit gets real out here. Um, it is, but I do rituals, as I was going to say, and I'm very serious about my rituals. Um, I try to grow most of my stuff that I use, okay? My lavender. I got lavender all over the place, right? Um, my rosemary, you know? I just love these herbs. So Pisces, like I said, let's praise God that we are here with our eyes wide open, right? Um, I hope that everybody enjoyed their holidays, um, the 4th of July. And, I mean, we had the 4th of July and that. It's nothing like being independent. It, it ain't nothing like, you know, we, we live in a world of chaos, but it could be worse, right? It could be worse. So we could be somewhere where it, it's worse than this. All right? Mm -hmm. All right, Pisces. Let's get down to freedom. Thank you for all those, like I say, who like. Subscribe to my YouTube for the old ones and the new ones. Thank you a million, right? For the old ones and the new ones. Thank you a million. Um... For those who go onto my web and purchase any of my items, know that whatever address you got is where it goes to. I cannot keep focus on where you live, what apartment you live in. You got to keep track of your package and, you know, where you send it, where you tell me to send it, that's where I'm going to send it to. I cannot control if you live in a building that they steal your shit and all that. I ain't got nothing to do with that. Once it goes out, it goes out. All right? Um, for those who get readings from me, know that I only do FaceTime readings. And that's all I do. Um, I do not do um, email readings. No, I feel like if you're going to pay for something, you need to meet the person. And I get to meet you and you get to meet me. All right? So that's like the greatest thing that I love to do. Um, just to see you, all right, put the face with the name, the name with the face, you know, um, so my readings are worth what you're paying for, and anybody get a reading from me will be able to tell you that, all right, so uh, make sure that you keep up, keep up with your spirituality, and I'm telling you something, Pisces, if you learn to live in your spirituality, your life will be so different. Dif when I tell you different, different, right? Totally different. Um, if you learn to live your spirituality, that's like eternal. I mean, even when you leave this earth, it's eternal. Like, there ain't no money. No amount of money that can buy your spirituality. I'd rather be wealthy in my soul. In my soul, honey. I'll be a billionaire in my soul. In my soul. Before I sell my soul to the devil. And it's some real shit. When you become in your spirituality, Pisces... The things that you go through in your life, it will not be as hard as you think it is. Because God will always, always, always be there for you no matter what. Believe me when I tell you this. I'm a witness of it. I mean, I'm truly a witness of it. It's, it's always on point. He has never failed me, ever. And it's weird because when you're in your spirituality, he knows when to give you your rest. He knows when you tire, when you can't take no more. He's there 
to make your life more easier than you could ever think. But you got to embrace yourself, Pisces. Because you are the highest priest and you carry the cross so well that people don't even imagine how you're doing it. But you're doing it. They can't even imagine what you go through. Because you make everything seem so easy. But it really ain't. But you got to live in your spirituality world. And when you light that lantern, the walk through the walk, trust and believe me, you would never have to look back at the darkness because God will always light your path. And I'm telling you the truth. He will light your path. With that being said, if anybody go onto my web and purchase any of my items, if you buy candles from the store, make sure that you use flower water and, you know, and cleanse your candles. Cleanse them. Okay? Cleanse them. Because you don't know how many people been in them. I buy my glass I make my own candles. All right? And it took me a minute to get it the way I wanted. But I have. And I mastered how I want my candles to be. All right? If you feel that things is not right or the energy is not right, and you know Pisces better than anybody what I'm talking about. Then you can burn the black magic spellbreaker candle, or you can buy the brick red dust, all right? And sprinkle it in front of your doors and around your house if you don't have a house and live in an apartment in front of your doorways, okay? But make sure you cleanse and you sit things outside and cleanse it before you bring it in your home. Okay? Because you don't know how many people touch your candles or how many energies. Alright? So this is the Black Magic Spellbreaker Candle. This is the Abundant Prosperity Wealth Growth all right, healing, fertility candle, nature, totally nature, right? This is the love yourself candle. Honey, do you know you are the greatest, the best of all? Love yourself. Love yourself more than you can love anyone. Don't give yourself a headache over somebody else. Give yourself a headache over yourself, right? Because you don't need nobody approval. Your own. You don't need nobody to give you a headache. Give yourself a headache. What the fuck? About yourself. Not about nobody else. This is the justice candle. And I always burn the justice candle. This is the Palo Santo. And this is what I make. And it's my Palo Santo. It smells so good. And this I bought from, um, I think, Home Depot or Walmart. And they only 79 cents. And they fit perfect. Ain't that cute? And so um, my oils come in oil form and also in dry form, right? You can put in anything you want. Your bath water, your shower, just put a little bit on, just in your hair, in your shampoo, in your lotions. When you cleanse your house, just use it, all right? Cleanse your house the way you know how to do it, right? This is the walnut, and the walnut is good to work your dark side, your your um, shadow side. And, you know, when you start working on your shadow side and you start facing everything about yourself, it can be scary because you actually facing your skeletons, right? What you, who you are, where you've been at. 
what's been going on with you, keeping it real with yourself, okay? Um, this is my jewelry, right? And I make them all. It's my scrub salt bath. And everybody knows that I'm good for this. This is what I'm known for, right? And I sell herbs in a bath that you take a bath with. But if you don't have a bath, you can take a shower with just like I'm going to hang that in my shower. Okay? Yes, honey. And whenever I take a shower, I ask God to cleanse me. Cleanse whatever I have collected throughout the day. All right? It's important that you cleanse yourself. Just like you put soap on your body. Every chance you get, whether you're washing dishes, whatever water is touching you, cleanse yourself. All right? Let's get started with the reading. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm 16 minutes in the reading and in, in telling you everything that try to help you as much as I can to show you how to do your rituals. You know, it's important that you get to know yourself and then you don't have to go through all the bullshit other people put you through because you will know better. You won't repeat it. You won't feel like you're going through the same cycles. Over and over and over again. All right? All right, here we go. Art Michael Jonah Art, please help me do this reading. The first reading you get is the Queen of Pentacles. Just, I mean, she is well made. She holds a coin. She's mother figure. She cares, right? She don't need no one to make her. She don't. Show off what she got. She don't have to. She don't. She's not out there impressing people. No, she's not. She's the kind of person that really don't want nobody to even know how she lives. Right? But she's caring and she will give you anything. She will give you help. She will give. She will mentor you. You know, she has more than enough. And she gives with an open heart. And she's not flattering. She's she's very low key with everything she got. You won't even know what she got because she's not out there t telling the world how she lives and what she got. She don't have to drive name brand cars. She don't have to wear expensive stuff because she is who she is. All right, her money's large. All right, she don't have to impress nobody. And it's a good thing, Pisces, because you don't have to impress nobody. You don't have to tell people anything that you do, what you got, or what, what what's going on in your life. You don't have to say it. So it's best to keep it to yourself, all right? It's, and stay low-key as possible. The less people you have around you and the smaller your circle is, the better you're going to be. You don't need to keep looking at the past. It's the darkness. Look at the brighter side, the future. When you think about the past, it's the darkness. When you think about people that don't want the best for you, it's the darkness. If you know somebody hurt you and you want to bring them back into your life, it's your darkness. Remember that. If you don't know nothing, about Pisces Studio. Remember that when you keep looking at your past, you looking to repeat lessons. Do you understand? All right? You don't need to look. You need to look forward where you can see. Okay? You can't walk backwards. You got to walk forward. You don't have fucking eyes behind your fucking head. All right? You carry your, your heart on your chest. Right? Do you understand? Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. And things will be moving fast for you. All right? You will be making moves. Right? 
you see it yellow, abundance, the yes, the sun shining. You see that it's, it's bright green, right? Right? Are you traveling? Are you moving? Huh? Are you making moves in your life that you don't tell nobody? You know, it seems like you're going somewhere. And the best thing about this is that I see these wounds coming at you. So something is coming fast towards you because you see it. Here's the where they shooting it. And it, it's shooting towards you. You're here and it's coming like this. So something is coming very fast to you and for you. Right? And it's the wounds. It's... Very fiery. What 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 are you looking to do? What do you want besides chasing the love? What do you want? It's, it's more than that. Life is more than that. Do you understand? Don't take your focus off what really matters to you. Tell me more. And you got somebody young. This is young. This is the beginning of things that are happening your way. But it's like everything is going this way. This way. But it's something coming to you fast that's going to open up something here. And you may be dealing with somebody young. And you're looking at like, what? Like somebody is young. Like they're looking at that stick like, yeah, this is me. Maybe they looking at their privacy like maybe it's somebody younger than you looking at. Yeah, that's all me. All right? Because they're pages and they come with news delivering something. All right? Something that you waited for. Something that you want to start. A new avenue. A new pathway. All right? At beginning, it's the beginning of this. It's just like starting for you, right? Something that you wanted, eager to come to you, eager to come. It's like running towards you, speeding like, like, like shooting so fast. And then it's like I'm opening to you. I'm opening this door to you. Are you seeing it? It's something new and exciting that's coming to you. And it may be very younger than you. Or starting something like a baby or infant opening up doors for you. But the page of one is like a sketch. What you see. What you see. What, what are you thinking about? Like what are you seeing? What are you picturing? What is your imagination? Where are you going with this? Remember, Pisces, we are the greatest to imagine what we want, how we want it, how we see it. You know, that's our problem. We, we think a lot. We, we think of what, how we want this, how we see it. Um, always work in our imaginations, right? Um, now, but the page of wands is fun. It's, it's um, uh, they learn by just going for it, right? So something is coming fast, but you got to learn just by going with it. They are courage and eager to try new things. Hmm. Very creative, intelligent, but gets dissatisfaction when they don't not master it fast enough, which leads to them to leaving in a project midway. So, it's like this. You may be moving fast to what you want to do. You're the queen of pentacles. Right? And you may be saying, well, I want to start doing this. And I want to do that. But you don't stay with it. Right? It's like, it's fun for a moment. And then now you put it back on the back burner. And you got all of these different things you want to do. But everything is on hold. Because you get bored with it. And Pisces like that. Pisces, we're like that. We're like, 
if you master something, you can't continue to keep doing it. You get bored it. You get bored with, with, um, with projects. It's like you want to move to the next thing. You know, somebody told me yesterday, Miss Lisa, no, this morning, Miss Lisa, you're doing this and that. Yes, I am doing this and that. You got a lot on your plate. No, I don't. No, I don't. I ain't got a lot on my plate because I got doors that are open up that I got to start. And believe me, when it started, it's the way I want it. And when it's the way I want, I can move to the next project. Right? Because that's what you do. You can't be in one place. All, well, you can if you don't want to work. If you want to work for somebody else, then yeah, you're in, a, in the same damn place. In the same fucking place. But if you run your own COE, like God is my COE, he going to make sure that my shit is opening up. Why won't God want me to keep moving on up? And that's what he said. Open this, start it off, and get somebody to run it. Open this, start it off, get somebody running. It's just that damn simple. People make things so hard because it's like, I got to be there to run. No, 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 no. No, sorry. No, sorry. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. No. Mm-mm. 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 No. It's many things that you can do that you don't have to be present. And you still make your money even when you're sleeping. Many things. Okay? You, you, I can't be three different places at one time. But I know how to run it. And that's what matters. Okay? You can't say, I'm going to do, I'm going to do, I'm going to do, I'm going to do. And then don't never do nothing. But you got all kinds of shit waiting for you to do. And you ain't never do nothing with it. What the hell? What is up with that? I master making my own jewelry. I master making my own candles. I make my own salts. And I order good shit. I make sure my shit is top notch. All right? And I master the game. And that's what it's telling you. Are you bored? Do you get bored with a job that fast? All right, you can be you can be a nurse all day long if you want. You can you can get a job and keep moving around from job to job, being a nurse, flying here there, because that's the way it is now, right? When you are RN, you gotta fly all over just to make money, all right? Unless you live in New Jersey, right? My daughter's the law. She's she knows her shit, and she living very good as an RN, and she done moved up. All right, but that's what it is, right? But you got to be somewhere where you can grow. If you somewhere where you in one, and they said, well, I work for um the Timo, Bo, Timo, T, what is it? T, the phone company, Timo uh, phone company. And I can grow. How high can you grow? How high can you grow? That's in anything. Restaurant. All right? But when you get to doing your own shit, then you can grow and constantly grow. You can be good at making just cupcakes and make, put all your kids through school. You can have a stay and selling hot dogs and live fucking good. Okay? But you got to get going with the program because you can say everything you want, what you're doing, but you ain't doing shit. All right? But still, right where you're supposed to be. Well, I don't know what, I don't know. I'm just happy just sitting here typing shit. Answering the phone. I, I don't know what to do. Well, you don't know what to do with your life and, and you don't want to grow. Some people go to college and still don't, and got degrees and ain't doing shit with their degrees. Not a damn thing. 
And they want to tell me what the hell's wrong with me. No, what the hell's wrong with you, Mr. Smartass? What the hell's wrong with you? You still clocking for somebody else. But you hating on me. No, honey, you can, you can be the smartest person in the world and be stupid at the same time. You can go to college and get all the degrees you want and you still ain't doing shit. A perfect example is, perfect example about this is, when they went down there to see the ship, engineers, we got top engineers building something to go down there to see the damn ship. They've been down there for many, many years. And look what happened. These are um like engineers. You can have doctors here, honey. And let me tell you something, and I'm being honest with you. My mother went to the doctor. My mother, when my mother was alive, I was seven years old. She went to the doctors. She went there for them to remove a needle from the sewing machine that got stuck on her finger. Do you know that that doctor sewed right over that needle and they had to cut my mother's finger off? A doctor! Like, let me tell y'all some, honey. You better know it. But they think they are, uh, oh, something wrong with Pisces. Oh, okay. We're going to let it look like that. Something damn sure is wrong. Well, as smart as you can be, just as lunatic you are. Like, you can be smart as fuck with the book and dumb as hell in the streets. What the fuck is that? All right? Shit. Hoes in the streets are smarter than most people, okay? At least they get paid to do what the fuck they're doing. Shit, at least they ain't giving up pussy for free. Taking care of motherfuckers. Right? Hello? I mean, shit. Shit. You don't see nobody out here? I need to go see this broke nigga. And all these other females. Well, I'm going to go see this one even though I don't give a damn. But he damn sure doing something. And I don't bring, I don't mean uh, bread crumbing your ass. I mean taking care of shit. Okay? Not bread crumbing you. Not giving you two here, two. I'm talking about taking care of you, all right? That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Yes. All right? Tell me more about this queen. So this queen of pentacles, things are moving at her. Things are moving towards you, Pisces. But you might get bored real quick and not get nothing done. All right? You need to get shit done and stop procrastinating what you want to get done. If you move the way you move for a, for a man or a woman, you'll be rich. If you had that much mentality that you put that much into somebody else, just trashing your ass, all right? Don't want shit to do with you, but you, oh, but I'm going to wait on it. There it is. Okay? Tell me more with this queen. Break free from the shit, damn it. Cut the shit off. Break free. Do you see that? Look at that. Tell, open up the curtains, damn it. Damn right. This, this will be me. I don't know about y'all. Open up the curtain. Slash, slash. Open it the fuck up. Yeah, I'm cutting shit off right the fuck now. I'm loose. I broke loose. I'm free. Free the ace. Free yourself. Free yourself. You can free yourself anytime you want. All right? You do not have to. You don't be the queen of pinnacles and take care of trash people. Right? They want to trash your ass, talk about you like a dog, and want to sleep with you whenever they want. In and out. In and out. In and out. In and out. All right? Now, break free from that shit. 
pray free for me. Because who is, is the sugar mama? Because that's what they look at you. Sugar mama, sugar daddy. Okay? Whatever Pisces you are. All right? Break free from this shit. All right? You got the justice. Okay? Justice will be served. And things will come to light. Karma. All right? When you go to court, you find the truth. And the truth will set you damn what? Free. All right? And things are going to be moving fast. So you thought that court is going to be moving very fast. All right? The paperwork and all that. Look at this. This is why you got the page of wands, right? Because guess what? Oh, my God. I got all this work to do. I got this, that, 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 that. I don't have enough time to even start this project. Because I don't have time because I'm over here doing so much work. And look at you sweating. Look, look at the time. Look, look at all the shit you got to do. How am I? I this is just why I don't want to do nothing else. Because I don't have enough time for all of this. I'm always, it's like somebody's working their ass off and can't even get started on a project or not because you don't have the time. Okay? You working and 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 working. For who? For what? You need to free yourself. All right? Free yourself. Bring balance to your life. Right? And whatever it is that you need to do. All right? You need to do it. All right? Because whatever it is you're waiting on, whether you're going to court, whatever. Whatever it is that you waiting on, it's going to be taken care of and it's going to work for you. Because you are like, I can't get it right. All right? And I'm going to tell you what, Pisces, it breaks my heart when I look at stuff like this and then you doing all of this and you can't even think and you so damn smart. But you got somebody playing with your fucking brain. Right? And you know you shouldn't be looking back. You should be looking forward. Alright? I mean, it is what it is, honey. People only play as far as you let them. You sit there sweating, doing all this shit. Oh, it's almost time for me to go and I got all this work that I still got to do. You can't even keep up with your damn self because you're doing everything. And somebody might work in the justice system. Somebody work in a um, law firm. Somebody might work in whatever it is. It's a lot of work to be done. Or taking somebody to court or legal matter. All right. But oh my God, when? When is, when is just this going to happen? I'm just wanting to be over with. When I want to break free, honey, don't break, don't let me bring that damn saw off and start cutting shit off. What? I'll show you how to cut some shit off. Yeah, that's why they be like, well, I don't know, because she, yeah, you don't know what, what you know, what you what, 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 what don't you know? Did I will cut your ass off? You don't know, because you better ask somebody, I will, I will, honey, I ain't got time for the bullshit. No, I don't play no games. Mm -mm. Justice will be served. Okay? And everything will come out to the light. Karma is a motherfucker. And it's going to come to set the story straight. And things is going to be balanced. And it's going to be equal. Alright? You sweat your ass off? Trust me when I tell you this. Tell me more about this sword. Look at this. The Ten of Wands. Oh my God, I need to break free from this. I'm tired of carrying all them watermelons up, the, up this hill. This man need to get a damn car. Why do I got to walk up here? This, I mean, come on, Pisces. You got everything. You got somebody breaking your back, putting all this weight on your ass. Unnecessarily weight. The damn man look like he ain't even got a damn car. Damn. Shit. It got you carrying.
carrying all the shit on your baby, please. This, mm -mm, mm -mm. do you see how far you got to go with them water bottles on your back? You need to break free because you're the one that's got it together. You need to leave some shit alone. What is this justice called, Lord? I mean, come on, Pisces. What is going on here? What is going on? Thank God the sun came out. And when you, whatever it is, it's going to be moving fast. This court case, whatever it is, the sun will shine and you will get what you want. All that shit they put you through, paybacks is a motherfucker. They going to get it. Okay? Look at this. So then, you open up the door and you're like, okay, I want to make this, but oh, I'm so busy doing this that I ain't got time to do this. It's like you spend so much time doing something else that you don't even put enough time on your for yourself. Right? And then, but look at this. The seven of wands means, look at this motherfucker. A fucking, look how he's watching you put everything up, but he's looking at you like, it's a storm coming, honey. And he's supposed to be helping you, but he ain't helping you. You doing all this shit on your own. It shows it here on your own. Do you understand? If I was you, I would throw whoever it is out the door and come get your sh whatever it is that they got. And if this person don't even live with you, you need, need to leave this person alone because this person here don't want good things for you. They hating on you. Do you understand what that means? They want to be like you. They want to, girl, they not trying to fucking, they let them. If it's up to them, I'm going to let the water come in the Pisces. But you making sure you put your beams up. And this person acting like they want to help you, but they're not. They looking behind you. Okay, let me, let me sneak away. Let me get away with this. It's like somebody wants to be like you. They just try to be so hard like you. But they envy and jealous, all right, of what of everything about you. Ain't one thing. It's everything that they don't like about you, all right? It's like you got to fight these motherfuckers. It's like open enemy. The door is open for somebody to take advantage of you. You got to set boundaries with this person. Because if you don't, they're going to drown your ass, okay? You want to escape the surroundings that you are in. You are full capable of standing strong through the um through all of this chaos that you are facing. But be aware of your um advantage. All right, you have full rights to set your uh to set your boundaries. All right, a small gateway is recommended. That means a small gateway is recommended. So that means the door. It's, a, it's something that's opening up that you need to get the hell out of there and leave this person alone. You got to put locks on your doors. You living in a world of chaos with somebody? They're getting on your nerves. It might be a child of yours or something, but they just trying to you got somebody that's going to court, whatever it is, honey, court matter, whatever it is, you need to leave people alone, honey, that is not for you. Because these people are a bunch of fucking haters. And it may be your own damn family, your own kids. People you think they love you, they don't love your ass. They don't want to do nothing. Shit. I cut free from them people. I cut their asses off. I don't care who it is. Family, friends, fuckers, or not fuckers, I don't give a damn who it is. I cut your ass off so fast you you will fucking know who the fuck I am. And I don't look back to come back. Once I say I'm done, I'm done. You play with me if you want to, then you're going to see the side of me you never seen before. Honey, I will go show ass and you will be poof out like you never existed. Yeah, you must remember one thing. My birthday is February the 19th. I was born with a sword before I even got the cup. So you know what I do? I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you exactly what I do. This is what I was born with and this is what I would do. Right to your heart. If you play with me. Okay?
And that's all I got to say. You need to get your shit together. Because if you don't get your shit together, they're going to come and get you. Do you understand? I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.